Hey, what's up? Two Mostly Ball Guys here. Today we're going to show you how to decat your stock Harley exhaust system. Uh, we are in a different location. We're at my dad's house, which who is the film guy right now. Blake, you want to add anything? Uh, we're going to show you a different, couple different ways. Uh, we're going to show you uh, drilling it out, and we're going to show the, well, a couple people will create a window. Uh, we're not going to do that way. We're going to actually do we're gonna show you another how to way of cutting it and then re-welding. So uh, let's go ahead and get to it. All right, this is the first way. First way, go to the store if you'd like to do it this way. Get you a paddle bit, a long one. Um, one that'll fit into the pipe. I don't know what size. What size is that one? One inch. One inch. That's a, this one, is one, that's inch. a one inch. You can get, I'm sure, bigger that would fit, but uh, this will work just fine. Stick that out down in there. It's just ceramic. All right. After you've drilled for a little bit, uh, just turn it over and dump it out. And it falls out this one and it'll fall out of that one even though they're both connected yeah it's all hollow where the cat is the cat is literally oh about <laughs> there to about there and let's can you see down in there let's see he's drilled a couple different places as you can see he's going right through it and that's only after maybe 15 30 seconds worth of drilling with a really old doll paddle bit. You see down in there? It did drop way off that time. I think you're through. Yeah, it looks it's, like it's, it's really, it wouldn't really focus. Close. There it goes. That went all the way through. All right. All the way through. And now you just try to knock, knock it all out and comes out in chunks but if you don't have a welder and you want to spend some time and uh, drilling it out you just keep doing that let me see if I can zoom in here focus well there's part of it gone and then there's all that but you can keep chiseling that away um, but we'll also show you the other way of doing it all right, since you've seen the drilling part, which it does take time, but you don't have to weld it, uh, we're gonna show both, so we'll go ahead, cut it open the other way and uh, remove it, and then you can weld it back together, which is what a lot of people show. Okay, so we've got the exhaust clamped in a vise. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut away at this weld right here. Um, a lot of people cut a window, um, you can either do like a full rectangle window there and then remove the piece um, or you can just cut your U, fold it open and then we're going to cut all of this weld here and completely separate this piece and then knock it out. Um, that way when we re-weld, we're just replacing this weld here. Um, that's just what we choose to do. So you can do it however you want. Um, but this is the way we're going to do it and it'll make it easier to weld it back together. All right, for this you need a die grinder here. And, or you can use a cutoff wheel. Um... Make sure you put some safety glasses on too. I have earmuffs behind me too if I need them. Yeah. So, yep. He's gonna block the camera. Sorry. Come on now. So 
now he's got that cut. We can set that off to the side. As you can see where we were drilling it out, but we didn't continue with it because we're going to show this portion of it. So, uh, we'll go ahead and from the other side of it, let me come around here. We're going to take something and beat it out through this and it'll come out through the other end. Watch your head. Okay. Stick it in there and pry against it and bend it. Hold it, just hold it down there and I'm gonna slap it. Let me dig that out. Oh. I'm gonna say you got a real screwdriver. Now dump it on the floor. Or hit the back of the vise or something. There you go. So basically, you can start by drilling your hole, your paddle bit. And if you had cut, if you cut a window out anyways, a zolzol is not going to do anything. And a lot of people end up using uh, an air hammer, which we have over there. But since we just decided to go like this, so we can clean everything out, we can use a zolzol down in there with the hole. But as you can see, it's you know it's in there. Turn it other way. This is what I want to do. Drill bar. Don't breathe the powder, people. Well, the platinum, you'll be worth a lot. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. <clears throat> so basically what we did was, uh, with that hole there, stuck the sawzaw in, cut in there a diff couple different ways, and now we're just prying the remnants out after we beat it down with the pry bar. After this is all said and done, you go to your buddy with a welder, weld those pieces back together and you'll be good as new. All of it's gone. We'll clean up and it'll be good to go. After you're done, uh, just clean up your edges and everything. And you don't even really have to because you're going to have guards covering all of this. But clean it all up. It'll butt up like that. And then weld, weld around the, the seam again. You'll have a new weld and you won't have any cut open areas back here it'll look like it's never been done all right hopefully
hopefully that video helped you out. If you have any questions, feel free to comment. Um, the welding, find a friend to weld it back together for you. Um, all If you need any help with removing the exhaust, I'm sure there's a whole bunch of other videos out there telling you how to remove exhaust from Harley. Um, all it is is two bolts per pipe on the heads. And then you've got the saddlebag you got to take off and then you got to remove your hose clamps that hold the shielding on and that's it to remove it um adam would take us maybe an hour maybe an hour to do this and we and we messed around because we wanted to show you two different ways so if you wanted to do it with a uh, a paddle bit so you don't have to weld it because you just want to open it up then there's that way. We wanted to show you what it looked like to do it both ways. But yeah, all in all, an hour tops to do, to cut it open, clean it out, and done. All right, well, uh, make sure you guys click that subscribe button, and uh, we'll see you guys next week.